All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So today is Monday. It means we are playing the new deck, new lineup, the final lineup of Daily Duels, which will be ending on November 2nd, which is episode 1000. We are playing with Magician Girls. You have spoken? We're playing with Magician Girls. Okay, all right. Uh, the lineup this month is not the strongest of decks, but there are some interesting decks, definitely new, things that I've never played before. So this should be interesting to at least try out, you know, to see uh, what awesome things we can pull out. So Magician Girls, uh, the deck... I didn't want to do Dark Magician. There's, so there's no Dark Magician in this deck. I did not want to do Dark Magician. The reason why I didn't want to do Dark Magician is because I didn't want it to be too Dark Magician based. I was kind of worried that if I made it more Dark Magician, it would be too Dark Magician if you get my if you get my drift. So it's the Magician Girls with Dark Magician Girl, right? So, I mean, we, how? We got Dark Renewal. And Dark Renewal is so good because it can interrupt my plays. And that's what the deck is going to try to do. I'm going to try to interrupt my opponent's plays. I'm going to try to pretty much uh, play during their turn, prevent them from doing plays, and one-up them and make them run out of resources. This is pretty much the gist of what I'm trying to do. So we can go ahead and summon Barry Magician Girl. Barry Magician Girl can go ahead and give me that search. So hopefully I do this right, you know. Hopefully I can do these uh, these decent plays. So I, yeah, I can search the OG. I was wondering if I could search the OG, if I could search Dark Magician Girl, and I, it seems like I can. So does she do anything? I don't think so. I think she just it's just Dark Magician. Like okay, so I think I should just try to get like as many Magician Girls involved in this duel as possible. You know, like I can summon her, then I can tag her out with Magical Dimension, summon Kiwi, Kiwi, pop one of his monsters, attack with Kiwi, you know, then I'll have Dark Renewal, which can, of course, tag out into another Magician Girl. Like, overall, I think that uh, being able to uh, get in this duel involved with multiple Magician Girls is actually going to really benefit me. The thumbnail? The thumbnail is difficult. Difficult. I mean, I, I should know searching up freaking, you know, Dark Magician Girl, anything involved, was going to be a fucking, uh, fucking trap shoot of porn, right? I mean, come on, it's... Just ridiculous, right? So we're actually not gonna activate you because I'm actually gonna tag out into you, Kiwi Girl. So we're gonna tag out into Kiwi Girl and destroy his monster. It sucks that this card floats. Like it really does. It's like a Lagusta monster float, they float, they float. So I think I might just leave it to him synchro summoning. And then I can, you know, fuck him up with Dark Renewal, which I mean Dark Renewal can easily fuck his day up. And of course the more dark magician girls I get, the stronger uh the plays are, you know, and then Apple can go ahead and recycle me and all that good shit. So uh, I'm just gonna set some dark renewals, and then if you you summon, I can tag out into Magician Girls, and pretty much I'm just trying to one up you. Like that's pretty much the point is that I want you to overextend summon monsters, and I'm gonna get rid of your monsters and tag them out from my Magician Girls and fuck you up <laughs> and then fuck you up. That's pretty much the gist of this deck. So that is fine. That's fine. I'm gonna wait until there's actually an actual threat right now. Not really seeing anything. You can sink eight and go to like a starter or something. Like, now I'm gonna sink five. You're gonna go into this Gusta monster. This Gusta monster. I mean, you can target one against the other monster. You can target one against the monster. You can add right, a target to your hand. All right, your opponent takes any battle damage you with and battle the scars. Good, can I destroy that battle? Uh, I'm thinking that this is a pretty good time to go ahead and tag out because this card's actually a threat. So we're gonna go ahead and do Dark Renewal, get rid of your card and my card, and then I get to summon a Magician Girl for my deck. And then, <laughs> so pretty much you get to use resources and I get to just tag out. <laughs> Sucks that I have to be a Dark Spellcaster, so I have to summon Dark Magician Girl, so rip on that. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> This is, you have your brain research, so you can just keep on summoning, normal summon, getting more counters out, yep, and you're done. <laughs> so, the power of that was pretty decent. So this kind of sucks because I don't have any more Magician Girls, but I think I want to summon her to be a beater. I don't know. I don't know. No, no, I think I'm going to leave it alone right now. This card is just for my battle or my card effect. Hmm, hmm. Okay. I could target up to three Magician Girls, including Dark Magician Girl. So if I tag out Dark Magician Girl for Dark Magician Girl in the Dark Renewal, then, and then he kills my Apple Magician, I can add all of them back to my hand. Uh, we are running uh, Ayatomias, you know, we're, we're doing the plays, we're gonna do the plays. Do you have something to that? This card is destroyed by battle. The opponent's talking about special the Gusta monster from your deck, ew. That sucks. <laughs> that really sucks, I kinda don't want you to get that. Like, you float too hard. The floating is just so strong in this one. I say, with all my dark renewals, I can, I can kinda control what happens in this duel, and that's all, that's the whole point. But yeah, the thumbnail was bad. I was like, I was like, what's the least prerogative thumbnail? And there was like one with like apple and lemon. I was like, that's just fine, fine. They're not doing too, nothing too sexy. Titties hanging all out and shit. Because that was the majority of the art. Was they're just their titties hanging all out. 
All right, so this guy, he's destroyed a battle. You get to go ahead and summon as well. So this duel's going to be interesting because you can just keep on tagging out. I'm not even sure if I want to... I think I might just let that go because... Yeah, I think I'm going to let that go because I don't want you to float into anything else in Dexit. Like, I think I'm okay for right now. It's just... God damn it, Gustos, they float so hard. So fucking hard. <sighs> but... You know, he can sync rest, I'm mean, not gonna fuck him up with Doc Renewal, I can hit him with the Solemn Strike, so I think, once again, how this deck is play- I'm gonna play this deck and I'm gonna burn through your resources until you have nothing. Or you can just fucking not do anything and then just let me attack, like, alright. That's fine. I just need some Dark Magicians up in here. So, I mean, fuck it. I mean, if you're not gonna do anything, I guess I'll attack you and let you deck then until- I guess it would be the point that you don't have any more monsters. I guess that would be the gist. Or you eventually go into a monster where it's like, hey, I don't float from being destroyed by battle or sent to the graveyard. Because I know there's some of them that's like, yeah, like you. Like, you you definitely want to get killed. Because you you only get your effect when you're flipped, so I'm going to kill you right now. That's generally how when I duel with ghost monsters, how I beat them, is that I just down all out their decks from the floaty ones that when they're destroyed by battle and they're sent to the graveyard. And you have to start summoning the ones that don't do that as well. And then you just run out of plays. <laughs> uh uh, so, see, and now see, he's still he's still gonna try to float. Like I can give him that. So this card has to be destroyed by battle and sent to But I can just I can pop you with you know magical dimension, and then you'll just be like rip. You know, it just sucks that it has to be three other magician girls. So if I want to tag you out right now, it wouldn't be the most optimal play. I, I guess I'm gonna normal summon Berry Girl. Berry Girl's gonna go ahead and get me a search of Choco. I mean Kiwi, Kiwi. Yeah, Kiwi. No, the Kiwi. No, because they have to be different Magician Girls. And all I have is Barry and what's his name right now? God damn it. It always has to be different Magician Girls for cherries. So, rip on that. Like, I guess I'll get Choco. I was going to do a play. I was going to do a play right now. I think I still might do it. I think I still might do it. I'll also be get rid of Dark Magician Girl. Uh, I'm not sure if this card would be destroyed in a battle by card effect, though. Like, I'm not sure how end he's going to go. I guess I'll Magical Dimension and tag out Barry and go for Choco and then do that play. So, get rid of Barry, summon Choco, then this will pop your monster. And now all my Magician Girls can get it in! Go, my pretties! <laughs> and now I definitely can fuck them up because I have a renewal to stop your normal summons and tag you out, which doesn't destroy you. And I got the Solemn Strike, so... I said, this is just the first, a uh, first, a rough draft. I might edit it. Maybe, right now I'm running two items. I got that three. I mean, freaking the amulet dragon is just so good. Like, we already know that. Oh, okay. That's fine. And I said, I'm kind of waiting for a threat. Like, Teratop's not really a threat. But we already know. You throw the speedrun engine in, like, everything. The, the speedroid wind witch engine. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Oh, that's fine. I'm waiting for a threat. Well, if, uh, he has a normal summon this turn either. Like, that that's the thing. He has a normal summon. Yeah, so Taka Tom Borg's gonna go ahead and tag out. Now, you can only summon wind monsters, but you're probably gonna do that anyway. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, so you can go ahead and change that level. Like, it's six. And you know what? I think now's the time to go ahead and just do Dark Renewal. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of your Triad Dice, which is a Synchro Monster. Tag out my Choco Magician Girl for another Dark Magician Girl. Special Summon? Sure. It's, it's interesting, I don't even have to Special Summon. Like, I could just fuck you up just for the sake of fucking you up. Like, that's interesting. So now you got that, uh, the Terror Top. The thing is that he still has a, he, he still has his normal Summon, so he can just Synchro Summon. Oh, never mind, he can just do Speed Recovery. Like, yep, that works. Like, I don't even know what we're facing. We're just facing straight up wind right now. Like, all right. Nah, that's fine. I still have a Solemn Strike. I still have a Solemn Strike and another Dark Renewal, so... Rip on you. And these two can XC into, like, Magic Magic Magician Girl. Like, let's go! Like, we have plays right now. I think we're summoning into... Winterbell. Okay. So... I mean, that's fine. I still don't see the threat. What does Winter do? You're you gonna like attack and then summon? I still got the strike, so. Burn me for 500 or what is it, 1,000? Oh, yeah, sure. 
No, so like time its level times 200? Yeah, so 600. Ooh, wow. You gonna kill my Apple Magician girl? Or are you gonna run over my Dark Magician girl? I'm kind of wondering what you're gonna do. Like, I'm still in control of this duel, and that's why I wanted to try to make this deck a lot. You're gonna kill my Dark Magician girl? No. Of course, you have to go with this art for the Dark Magician girl, because she actually has, like, the art with the other Magician girls. Wow. And that's it. You're just gonna leave it like that. Alright, wow. <laughs> I can just fuck your ass up with QE Magician Girl. <laughs> Any player's turn, I can discard this card. Magician Girls become 300 attack and defense for each Magician Girl. Different names on the field and in the graveyard. Like, wow, like, I can I can just destroy you. Cause I, I know I have plenty of different names to, you know, wreck your booty hole. So, I think I'll, I think I'll do that. So, I'll go ahead and just enter battle phase. I'll go ahead and I take QE because I want to make sure that I have enough. Kiwi, and then they just get buffed up. Like, I think I have like three different names. So that's that's an additional nine hundred right there. No, way more than that. I, oh damn. Oh yeah, I'm the field too. Oh damn. So, Dark Magician Girl attack and attack game. Let's go. These Magician Girls just beat your ass. <laughs> Like that because I'm, I'm about to win anyway, so that's really all that matters. Is I'm about to win this duel. Yep, read a clear tag game. Ah, that W though. All right, we'll get another duel. Bear back. All right, another duel. That was pretty decent. That was pretty decent. I said, we're not playing that top tier shit this month, but we're playing interesting things. We're playing some fun stuff. That's all that matters. We're gonna wrap up daily duels, I guess, fun like, and then uh, what we do after that will be interesting as well, you know. It won't be daily duels, won't be doing videos daily of, you know, daily dueling, but we'll do something similar. Like I said, I'm planning on doing, like, maybe live stream, and then we can play whatever we want, and then that way, if the deck is shitty, I'm not stuck with it for an entire month, because, God, that sucks when, you know, I'm stuck with a deck for an entire month. Uh, so I can just summon Choco, then Choco can pitch the Dark Magician Girl, and then draw a card, and then if you attack the Dark Magician Girl, I can just pull her out of the graveyard, you know, Dark Magician out of the graveyard, and then, and then you attack the Dark Magician Girl, so... That's pretty decent. Oh, and I got my Antimice too, so I can go to my Amulet Dragon and all that shit. So, probably kind of took it slow here, because I thought he would uh, do it up. But no. Oh, wow. It's ABC taking it slow. Like, all right. Are you normal? No, you're only when you're normal summon. I was saying, you normal summon special summon? Like, nope. All right. Well, and then I still got Spot popping during my opponent's turn. It's just, am I going to get hit with a Twin Twister? That is the question. So, I'm just going to set everything, and you, you, you pick. You pick if you hit me with Twin Twisters. But you really can't attack into my Choco Magician Girl, and if you try to, like, fuck her up, I mean, I can always hop out of the way with Magical Dimensions and all that. So, uh, like I said, the, the controlling, the spot popping during my opponent's turn. It's my style of play, you know? I love Cosmojo, I love Witch and shit like that. Gear got it. See, I'm thinking about just tagging out right now. Like, I just tag out for for uh, my little Berry Magician Girl. What is, what is she summon? Once turned to another player's turn, the card is activated, the target attack pack, you can change your control. I can summon one from, I think from the deck. Yeah, from Dark Magician, from Girl from my deck, Magician Girl from my deck, and then it switched to that. So, you know what? We're just gonna do that, because I don't want you to plus, I don't want you to search. You know? So, let's go ahead and summon my Babu Berry. Destroy one monster? Sure. Pop that gear guy in, you don't need that. You don't need to fucking plus and search and do all that shit. Like, I'm controlling this duel. Wow, another another uh, mission circle. Oh, I seriously doubt you have any in your deck, so. I'm just gonna go ahead and attack you with Babu. Then since I'm attacking with Babu, I'm gonna activate Magician Circle. So, I'm gonna summon Spellcaster, and you know what the suck thing is? If he has, if this effect is mandatory, so if he has like Effect Veiler in the deck, he has to summon Effect Veiler. Like, that's funny. That's funny. And you know what? I'm going to go ahead and summon Dark Magician Girl, and then I can go ahead and turn her into something else with Aya Tamaya. So, do you have, like, a Fact Veiler? No? All right. Cool. Then I just get a free summon of a Dark Magician Girl. Awesome. So, I'm not going to set this because I'm going to go into, what's her name? The Fusion? Yeah. And then it's like, I can pitch a card to pop a card once per turn, and your player's turn, I can send one card from my hand to Gareth and target one face-up card on the field and destroy that target. That's pretty good. So, Aya Tamaya. My Dark Magician Girl into my big dragon villain. And I got still got vanity. It's like, 
Control the duel, control the duel. <laughs> Against ABCs, like, alright. <laughs> so if you play your filth spell right now, go ahead, play your filth spell and pop it with Dark Magician Girl the Dragon Knight. Dark Magician Girl the Dragon Knight. No, that's fine. Alright, Iron Call. Because I don't want to get rid of these monsters right now. Like, I'd rather wait for him to... See, it's not like he can go and talk to X-Tar or something. Anything that you summon to threaten you, like Castell or something, could just pop you, so... I'd rather see it and then not let the Silver Gadget go off. Wow, another Gear Giant. Like, really? Like, really? Another Gear Giant? Uh, kind of want to activate on Summon. Yeah, on Summon. But... Like, you're not plussing. You're not plussing. You're absolutely not plussing. Strike, that's fine. That's fine. I kind of knew he had a strike because I haven't really been playing any monster effects. I mean, come on, Solemn Strike. Card is ridiculous. It needs to be limited to one. Like, that card should not be at three at all. Card is way ridiculous. Like, it, it stops any Inherent Summon, any Inherent Summon, including Pendulum Summon, Synchro Summon, Xe Summon, any Inherent Summon, and any monster effect from anywhere. 15? And it's a counter trap? That's broken. That's broken. I don't care what people say. Oh, no, Strike doesn't need It's not broken. Fucking yeah, it is. Like... So Konami, you print in the 10, make your money, and then, you know, come next, let's go ahead and hit it. Hit it to one. Don't even do the fucking solemn treatment, because people generally play two anyway. Now, I've been noticing that three strike is kind of cloggy, depending on what deck I'm running. You know, if I'm running like a fucking cardamized deck, then, you know, let's go. But generally, it's kind of cloggy. Uh, now he's going to attack me. I don't even have any, like, magician, enough magician girls to even, you know, do this properly. Like, I'm going to go ahead and summon, but I don't, you know... I don't have because the attack target is slapped to them. Wow, see? See? How the fuck is that fair? How the fuck is that fair? He hit me with multiple Solemn Strikes, so I guess that's game. I got fucking destroyed by Solemn Strike. Like, I literally would have to top deck into like a fucking like a Kiwi or something. Oh no, no, like a fucking Choco. Like, ugh. Fucking Strike is so broken. Just set two strikes. Like, alright. Alright. Ugh, fuck me. Fuck me, of course it was fucking double Solemn Strike. Of course, because Konami wants double Solemn Strike to be legitimate. Like, I was in control of this duel for like a cool minute until I got fucking blown back in my Solemn Strike. Come on. Uh. What's this turn? This card is targeted for an attack. Well, I can flip up the Vanity's Emptiness on him so he doesn't do anything next turn. And then I can summon Choco, but I mean, in the end, he's probably going to be able to go off. Wow, I took, I took two solemn strikes to the fucking face. Yep, yep, solemn strikes, solemn strikes are totally day three. Three. Card's totally not broken. Like, ugh, fuck me. Like, strike, strike, like, for, for, would I pay 3,000 life points to stop double your plagues? Hell yeah. It's, all, it's not about life points, it's about resources. And I, who's out of resources? This guy. This guy right here, I'm gonna raise my fucking hand. <laughs> I can't believe there were double solemn strike. I, mean, I do play triple touch history in this day. I do. Uh, I was in control of this duel, but little did I know he's gonna tr control me with double solemn strike. Where's my solemn strikes? That would've been nice. I didn't get my, any of my solemn strikes. You already know there's strikes in here and I didn't get any of mine. Wow, and he's gonna hit me with, and then he gets his twin twister too? Wow, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. He gets his twin twister too. He's gonna go neg on the play, but it doesn't even matter because he's playing ABC, so he can just summon A and then go right into ABC Dragon, Buster Dragon. Like, wow. No, I'm gonna play him against the top tier shit, but they also get the top tier cards of True Solemn Strikes and Twin Twister. Like, I, I, I surrender. You got it. You got it. I'm playing fucking Magician Girls, I got destroyed because he had them strike. If he didn't have them Solemn Strikes, or if I would have got Twin Twister to clear out the Solemn Strikes, I might have been able to control that duel and win it. But, alright, we'll get another duel. Bear back. Wow, you know what? After the duel ended and I stand up pause recording, he you know these comedies like he's like easy. Nigga, you didn't even beat me with your monsters. You literally beat me with your fucking solemn strikes. But I guess playing solemn strike is easy. I mean, come on. <laughs> like wow. Oh, this hand is kinda shitty. Like hopefully uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get me Choco. Maxi, nigga, I'm not even gonna wow. Alright. I wasn't even gonna special summon this turn. Okay, alright. All right, all right, all right, all right. Give me Choco. I'm not even going to special summon this turn. Good, thanks for taking that neg. Like, if you were adding my cards and knew what I was going to do, got Lemon. Lemon's shitty. Lemon and Cherry are, are 
No, limited Apple are the two shitty ones. But it's interesting because of the thumbnails, but they're like the two shitty ones. Like I run three of every one except for limited Apple. They're only two because they're 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 kind of. <laughs> it's like everybody does something does what they do better, you know. Oh shit! All right, here we go. Fucking Dynamis. This deck is about to be straight up cancer. Straight up, you know. Not only can they go with level 5 machines so they can go into fucking infinity on your ass, but then they can also fucking, wow, but they can also hit you up with that fucking good, good water, water, uh, level 4s and go into bomb and shock for tree code. So they, they have access to double, like, to double my niggas, double. Yeah, I'm not going to get my effect, turn to defense, and, uh, I said it really doesn't matter what I summon, because I'm just going to get ran over anyway. Like, can you, like, summon to summon to summon? I'm kind of wondering if you can, like, keep summoning. I think I guess I'll summon Kiwi. Just for the name. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna die, clearly. <laughs> Actually, you know what? Probably shouldn't summon Kiwi, because if you kill Barry... No, he's gonna kill Kiwi anyway, so it doesn't matter. Effects are negated, so spec house monsters that control cannot be destroyed by card effect. Cannot be targeted, so... So, don't worry, I wasn't a terrible play. Oh, well, I got this play now. The sad thing is you can keep Pendulum Summoning and Pendulum Summoning and Pendulum Summoning and Pendulum Summoning. I guess I'll just go back to attack mode. <laughs> There's really no point in leaving myself in defense mode, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and summon Choco. Choco, pitch Dark Magician Girl, draw. Because if you attack an enemy, then I can summon Dark Magician Girl from my grave and then you're halved. Anything, I kind of think he went neg on that play. Like, he's not reading my cards. Like, really? Like, limited removal to double your attack? Like, at least you get to go back to the extra deck, right? And if I could summon my Dark Magician Girl, I got the Eye of Tamias right here, and go into my Amulet Dragon, start pitching cards and popping cards. Like, that's pretty power. Yep. Turn to him summon. Yep, yep, yep. So, are you going to attack Berry Magician Girl again? Or are you going to attack Choco Magician Girl? Choco Magician Girl, all right. Dark Magician Girl effect. Go ahead and summon dark, back Dark Magician Girl. You got some strike? Nope, nope. Dark Magician Girl. Have, and you attack her. <laughs> nope. And you're dead again. Magician Girl's like fucking around. Right? They control. They control. And now I can just turn this Dark Magician Girl into fucking good, good. Yep. I said I might up. I had some nice. I mean, I turned a Dendro Tool in this duel. But it's still really great. All right, that's fine. I'm gonna activate my effect still. Uh, I'll go ahead and pitch lemon. Lemon's shitty, and uh, I guess I'll crack your scales because your background doesn't seem like it's been a threat. Um, so there's one like you can deflect this on I once return if this card you put yourself while this card you put yourself activate it targets another dynamis card. And this one's like if a dynamis card you control be destroyed by battle by card effect, destroy this card instead. I mean, it really doesn't matter. Uh, and what pendulum skill are you? Because that's one less monster that I can choose from, so... Can I look at your extra deck? I don't think I can. Is there a fun to look at his extra deck? No, that's his graveyard. His extra deck. Yep, there we go. Six. So, I want to pop the one that's a six. And if he wants to switch to slap it over to the three, I really don't care. Yep. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Solid strike again. Yep, that's fine. Because I literally got rid of both of your fucking shits, and I still have plays, so... Um, I'm just go ahead and summon another Choco. Choco, activate your effect, pitch, lemon, draw a card. Oh, yep, there's Dark Renewal, so I can fuck with you during your turn. Uh, what do you have, like, Castell, Utopia, Utopia, Lightning? Like, yeah, we don't, we don't have any, like, Giant Hander or Rafflesia or anything like that. Maybe we could put Rafflesia in here. Wow, Cowboy would be nice right now. <laughs> yeah, that's my game. I'm 100 short. Rip. So, he used both of his set cards. You know, bombless and strike, uh, but just doesn't have anything. Like, he's drawing into one. Thank Christ I drew Dark Renewal, so that's nice. So if he, if he top decks until level 5, he Nova and Divinity, I can just fuck you up, you know? So you're just going to Pendulum Summon him again? Yep. Uh-huh. kind of want to get rid of Petra. Petra is kind of a threat. Like, I don't really care about ranks. Like, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get rid of that. So, you can get rid of Petra. I'm gonna get rid of my Barry. 
and I'm gonna summon Dark Magician Girl. Who can also go into items. Oh, right, right, that targets. That targets. Yep, yep, yep. That's fine. At least you cracked your scales. Because I was gonna crack your scales anyway. Wow, again? Again? You wanna get fucked up again? Alright. That's fine. So I'm just gonna summon Dark Magician Girl and you attack into her and die again. God. Wow, GG. GG. Alright, we're done here. Controlling. Uh, the, the fucking girls. The girls are putting in too much work. I didn't even get much back row this duel either. <laughs> Alright, so anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Like I said, you guys learned from Dr. Mag Magician Girls, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna put in this work. Uh, like I said, I might up to Tamias 3 because Tamias of Dark Magician Girls just so good. Like, just doing a little pitch pop during either player's turn, like, let's go, you know? Like, this is good. The fucking just controlling my opponent's place. Being controlled is my, it's my type of deck. It really is. So, anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Like I said, tomorrow, so you double Daily Duels again. We're gonna be tagging. Uh, I think playing Heratics. So. I've never played that deck pure, so just th really thrown in, so we're going to be seeing that, and we're going to be uh, doing the deck profile for Micklord Despots, yeah, so, yeah, deck, deck profile of what that deck is, I guess, alright, so, anyway, thanks for watching, people.